This is higher homework 4, it's question 8 that we're going to look at. So given y is equal to 4x plus 1 all over x squared, find dy by dx. So a straightforward uh, differentiation question. Well, in saying straightforward, we're going to have to prepare first of all before we differentiate. Right, so what I'm going to do first of all is I'm going to split this uh, fraction that we have here. And what I'll have is x squared as the denominator at each side. So my first line is going to be x to the power of 4 all over x squared plus that plus sign there. And then I've got the 1 all over x squared. Okay, uh, from there what I can do is I can then just uh, do some indices work to get the uh, x to the power on the, the top. Um, but first of all, what I want to show you is what I, what I see quite often with this type of question. So what I sometimes see would be someone writing y is equal to x to the power of 4 plus 1, and then that would be plus x to the minus 2. This one cannot be done. This one here is not correct. Okay, and from there you would be losing most of the marks in this uh, question. You'd be really hard to gain the, any of the marks out of this here. So be very careful. Don't just try and lift that to the top somehow, up to there, because that's certainly not correct, and it will not go forward to get you the correct answer from there. Right, we've got to split the fraction, and then we'll uh, just prepare it a bit further. So x to the power of 4 divided by x to the power of 2. Remember, just for indices, x4 minus 2 will give me x squared. And then what I can do with this single fraction, I can bring the x to the 2 onto the top, and it becomes a minus. From there, what we can do is we can go ahead and differentiate. So differentiating this one, 2x from that side there. I've got minus 2 times the 1 at the front, so that's going to give me a minus 2x. Reduce the power by 1, takes me to minus 3. Okay. On this side here, all I did was multiply two times the, the one that's at the front, gives me the two, take the power down by one, and so that's two x to the power of one, basically, minus two x to the, the minus three. I haven't asked you to show up with a positive index, but if that was the case, what we would do is we would then just grab this part here, the x to the minus three, take it down to the, uh, the uh, denominator, and that would go to x to the power of a positive 3. And that would be my final answer there. So I've got four marks that we're going to gain here. The first mark that I'm going to give is for splitting the fraction correctly there. Next mark for uh, doing some of the indices work and preparing that correctly. I'll give a mark for each of these. So that'll be one mark there and one mark there. So that mark for this one be out of four. Make sure you don't go this path here. Make sure you don't do that. Please be very careful when you're doing the, the uh, differentiation of fractions.